Brought to you by McGregor Flooring Company Limited. Top quality installations by a team of seasoned professionals. This afternoon we're at Lee Bend for the Premier 3 clash between Hamilton and Dumfries. Dumfries got three wins from eight starts, but they've come very close on a couple of occasions. And a win today would consolidate a mid-table slot for them. Hamilton, their line second in the table. Desperate to get back up into Premier 2. They've got six wins from eight starts. And they've got a very, very enthusiastic crowd behind them here this afternoon. Early on, pressure was on the Dumfries defence. Ball out to Ross Ingalls, going for the corner, taken out there. <laughs> Last minute tackle by Sam Hiddleston, but it saved the day for Dumfries. Still there at the line out by Hamilton and Stevie Turnbull having a wee dip, popping the ball. Forwards thumping in there. There's some big hefty citizens in this Hamilton pack, but they couldn't hold on to that one. A wee steal and cleared there by Sylvian Diaz. But straight to Ron Stridham. Stridham looking for a wee bit of space, beating a couple of tackles and swallowed up by the defence. And Dumfries offending there, spotted by referee Damien Timpson, taken quickly by Ross Ingalls, not getting... Too far before Adam Fries' hand was laid on him. And the referee spotted that one as well. Not back 10. And the most straightforward of penalties for Owen McLeish. Hamilton on the board. But it taken them 20 minutes to get on the board. The Dumfries defence pretty solid there and not letting much through at all. Oh, another steal at the line out there though. Picked up by hooker David McGrath. Almost over the line, Stevie Turnbull telling his backs where he wants them to be. And the ball slung out again, it's Ross Ingalls, way out wide. And this time, cutting inside, nice line. Who's he going to make it to the line? No, slipped there, only a bit of yard shot. And Turnbull again, out to John Selfridge. And the Dumfries defence having to work really, really hard here. Picked up by Grant McCowan, over the line, but... Stoting off one of his own players on the way. Uh, the next scrum, though, the Dumfries scrum absolutely splintered by a huge drive by Hamilton. Selfridge takes it on, laid back for Turnbull, swinging it out to the right. We fumble there by David Sutherland, but the penalty had been given, and Owen McLeish's kick made it six points to nil after 26 minutes. Dumfries weren't taking this line down, though. Great jump at the line out by Ali Mather. Scrum half Diaz, scragged there by the, the back row. And Dumfries not getting any momentum here at all. Diaz slinging the ball out to Hiddleston. Oh, mighty boot there. Dropping just outside the 22. Knocked back by Dumfries. And. David Sutherland popping it out, but the referee had spotted an offence. Up stepped Tom Hiddleston, and from that distance, he'll slot them all day. Getting Dumfries on the board after half an hour. And they just did a wee sniff that something might be happening for them. Bust through there by Sam Hiddleston. Diaz popping it up for Jamie Graham. Diaz again, Hiddleston, and you can see wee bits of the Dumfries game that if they only get it all together, they could be a very, very powerful side. And from that penalty, Hiddleston again slots it between the posts, six all, 33 minutes gone. Now we're waiting for a big surprise. David Sutherland taking the ball into the Dumfries 22. Selfridge arrives. But he's flying everywhere here. And Selfridge decided to take it on. Helped there by Fraser Watt. Grant McCowan in giving a wee bit of assistance. Richie Maxton. Ball up to Big Tomate Rind. Oh, they must they must get over from this one. So much pressure. But all credit to the Dumfries defence. They held out. 
until they gave away the penalty and Owen McLeish was the man this time who brought the first half to an end. Hamilton 9, Dumfries 6. Scrum Magazine. Subscribe online at scrummagazine.com. Brought to you by McGregor Flooring Company Limited. Top quality installations by a team of seasoned professionals. Into the second half, and that scoreline shows just how well Dumfries have been holding this powerful Hamilton pack, but they got on a roll early in the second half. And was that a try? No, held up, said the referee. Uh, they stayed well in the red zone. And oh, what's this number eight trying to do? Is he trying to get over the line or trying to hatch it? Well, it didn't matter. At the end of the day, it was Stevie Turnbull who got a hand to the ball over the line for the first try. And there was a real sense of relief about the Hamilton boys that they'd got that one. And McLeish's conversion taking it off, off the post, no less, to 16 points to six after 48 minutes. Kind of sloppy penalty there, straight to Craig Ingalls. Ingalls, oh, taken on two or three tacklers before he stopped. Quick ball back. Well worked out into midfield there by Hamilton. Rind out to Ash Mason. And Ronnie stride him outside. Was he going to make the line? Oh, hauled down just short. Hamilton needed quick ball. Exactly what they got. Turnbull popping it up and well taken by hooker. David McGrath, who crashed over for the try. And that's the one that really shut the door on Dumfries. Particularly after... Stridham popped over, not the easiest of conversions, but 23 points to six. Going into the final quarter, Dumfries, well, they were never going to lie down, and they had a fair few dips at the Hamilton line, but nothing that was really going to unpick a very, very solid home defence. And they needed quick ball, and they got it. Ross McMillan stopped in his tracks by David McGrath. Diaz... Burrowing away for it there. Out to Huddleston. Huddleston back into Kenny Brown. But again, the Hamilton defence absolutely solid when it needed to be. And they got the turnover. After all that work, going to nothing for Dumfries. Well, Whip back to David Sutherland and slammed away to safety. Danger over. Great take there by Robert Cowie. Hamilton giving the ball plenty of air. Ash Mason there shrugging off the tacklers up to the 10 metre line. Again looking for a quick ball, getting it. Turnbull, the ball finding its way to stride him over the 10 metre line. Only one man to beat. Ah, oh, picks a beautiful angle there. That was a cracking try by the big winger. Did all the work from the 10 metre line. And in under the posts to give himself the simplest of conversions. Two minutes to go. Final score, Hamilton 30, Dumfries 6. This year, this is our third home game because of the redevelopments at the club. We had to play most of our early games away from home. So it's quite good coming back here and, and showing the, the local support uh, how the team has developed over the last uh, few months. And uh, I think that there's a lot of fitness in the team, which is good, and that's making all the difference. Hamilton's new coach, Dale Lyon, a happy man there, and no surprise because they stay second in the table. And the priest, well, they'll play worse than that and win games, but Hamilton just too powerful for them on the afternoon. This is Ron Evans for Scottish Rugby Television at Leibent. <laughs>